Yeah, that's a catch. Kaj on Hajj. Yeah. Kaja carry. So. Ka Ka Kaji. I'll leave it there. Yeah. Or let's right. go Haji Kaja. Let's cool. So, <laughs> the fact that a lot more of the gold on the energy shielding went to his opponent, Oheb. Second turtle up in the game. Still watching the two junglers here. Blacklist International have a much better positioning, but in terms of the retribution, it's oh! going to be one up by Sensui. A half a second, a little bit too early by H2. Both teams back off. Reset. Well, they, uh, they still can. They, they can still use the Raphael. I think that they're underusing their heroes oh, now. Okay, H2 dives in. Finds Sensui. Astral Echo okay. spots out the members of Omega, but Sensui looks like he's not going to be able to survive. Yes, he does not. He falls, but Haji going with the Flicker Divine Judgment, picking off the opposing jungler. So, jungler for jungler trade by Omega in Blacklist. All right. Uh, oh. Good trade there, I'd say. Uh, but the fact that it was Omega who was the aggressor and yeah. Blacklist still getting something on the way out means they're not quite in the woods just yet. Yep. And Blacklist. You can see that it that, that lead was translated into that contest this going to be devastating. Yeah, they maybe they shouldn't. Maybe they should take this moment to say, hey, you know what? This is yeah. a what? 10 or 15 seconds of a free farm. Oh. Get to it, Jome. That's full vision. Oh, oh that's huge. Huge. Four but members spotted going into the bush. Okay. Finds one. They're going to be going after it. That's going to be Sensui falling really low. Jome with the blazing to win. Are they actually going to be able to take down the juggler? A Blacklist International down. Yes, they do. But they also lose H2. So juggler for juggler trade. You win. They're going to be able to land with the Star Shatter. Meanwhile, in the mid, Edward's going to be pushing out. Blacklist International counter back. I think Omega would be all the best to try and spot where he is. But that's easier said than done because Rebo, yes, he can throw random uh, bush checks. But he's oh. getting threatened oh to kill. Oh, what? Man. Five man! Astral Echo. And that's going to be a knockout by the Lord of the Damage coming in from Blacklist International. He's going to take down Ryota. The Ruby falls. And the Lord is going to go to Zinsui. H2 is going to lose a retro duel. Two members of Omega down. Massive win by Blacklist. TP by the captain. And, and surely Omega didn't realize that they will be hit by the knockup of the Lord because of their increased hitbox. They didn't calculate for that. Yeah. For sure, no, that's difficult to yeah. do. I no. mean, how many teams or how many players? Yeah. Perf I, perfect timing. I don't really remember ever saying, uh-huh, Edward, so yeah. much. Yeah. Okay, middle lane. sure. Oh, again. That's five men. Okay, you oh. were. Oh, no, oh, Pressing no. forward, Haji's going to be looking for it. Uh, he's going to get Joe because oh. divide judgment into the gold laner. Bad news for Omega's Blacklist International will now collapse on them without their gold laner. Omega doesn't have the damage, and the TPs are still out. H2 and Joe are down. Blacklist still in control, pushing forward. Big J eats a DJ, and now bottom lane penetrated. Wow. Blacklist knows they're in their control. I'm pretty sure Miz is going to follow up next. It's very hard to defend with just these three men. Yeah, you know what I call this right now? Respectful disrespect. I mean, they understand the uh, history of this rivalry. As Blacklist goes forward, will they actually be able to end this? The minion wave's coming in down to the bottom lane. It looks like Oheb just needs to lock in. Xword is going to go for the suppress and the stun and everything in between. But Blacklist International will just focus on the members of Omega whittling them down. The minion wave's not completely there and they back off. Oh. 8k. Yeah. Yeah. They can hear the music, but they can't come out to play as they send out five men. <sighs> so far, all of you as uh, Echoes have been 100%, even when the two members were dead. Yes. Because he hit all yes. three okay. men. Exactly. Ryoder going to be focusing on Sisui. Here comes a flag by three members of Blacklist International. They're going to get surrounded here. Haji goes in with the Divine Judgment, but actually stop. It was stopped oh! by with Jome, who gets the Lord. H2 goes back. But with Mega. Big J skedaddles alongside the rest of Omega. They score a big, big objective here. The Lord spawns at the bottom lane. Enough time for Omega to spawn their last hero, H2. Oh, Again, man. the game just extends. Yeah. But that was a definite hero play coming in from Big J. Yeah. Another 100% connection in the echo oh. from Yue. Yeah. Oh, oh, that hurts, that hurts. Okay, Exert going to be going in with the Divine Judgment on the Edward as well, using the Flicker. And that's going to be a kill on the Agent Zero. Omega showing a little bit of that old man strength. I know they're not that old, but let me go along with it. Blacklist will stop their siege. Oh, oh my, my god. god, are you kidding man? me? That's so many Astral Echoes in one game. Earlier it was Star Shatters. Oh my oh, god. Oh, Ryota going in with the ball onto Sensui, and Sensui gets bursted down, blazing the wet by Job. Oh, have already using the Wind of Nature. That's going to be... No trades, no trades happening. That's Omega actually just winning out that pickoff. I can hear the thousands and thousands of members of the Riot army cheering on Ooh. us. He survives that. He's been getting beat down all 15 minutes of this game, but here finally he's a threat. Oh. The, uh, the Atoy army. Again, but what whatever. is this? What what you, what, what are you on, man? Wait, 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 wait. Finally, Omega the pixel brush. Yeah. 
Take Omega score in their own purple, trying to at least give it the exhort, like and a, Lord retreats. It's like an angry slow dance between two divorced couples who are just forced to <laughs> dance together in the what? mixer. Two divorced couples, so it's four people. <laughs> two divorced partners. There we go. Okay. All right. Estranged lovers. Let's call it that. Estranged lovers. Oh, so we are going to be Oh, that's a natural echo. The divine judgment there onto Adrian. He's going to get bursted down. But the immortality pops up for the jungler. Of Black, and it looks like he's going to be able to get away. And Reaper going in with a massive holy baptism. But no, the Baksha falls. Blacklist almost loses their EXP laner. But Omega are pushing forward. They don't have a retry. Expert with his own divine judgment. He picks off Yue. Reaper and Job. Job with a massive blazing duet. He's going to focus on Oeb. He's going to focus on Oji. Satsui has that retry and he oh. gets it. Job now going to focus Edward. Edward in the mid! Edward in the base! Edward in the mid! Agent Zero! With a split push end! Abu Jing Jing Zero's Omega's base score in one for Blacklist International. It's all about multiple win conditions. And despite that victory, the Blacklist camp seems unhappy. Maybe because of some of the mistakes, some of the bad calls, but yeah. my oh my. If I were an agent, I would be very happy. I mean, a win is a win, right? Exactly. But again, as you mentioned it, and what, they're pulling the mirror. The, yeah. They're mirroring Blacklist. You saw <laughs> X-Word even gave H2 like a little bit of a high five. Like, oh, you can do this. Jungle oh, Nathan, like, oh, mid barracks. I, I forgot yeah. oh, the word for it, but Mino and Fury hey, hey. onto two. Oh. H2 able to get away on time, but this is actually the purple buff going to the Sensui. Exhort to the members of Omega pressing forward. They're trying to chase after Haji, but they don't. Jump! Big With play! A flicker! I'm offended, ultimate by the Ruby. And even Omega were a little bit surprised because it doesn't look like they're completely ready for that one. Jump not trying to survive, but Oheb takes him down. By blacklist means. I feel like it's going to be too risky if Omega try, yeah. but. H2, by the way, stole the purple buff with using oh, the ultimate! Oh, H2! of the Petrified, the full combo of the Benedetta! Oh my god. That should not have been the case! Omega now trying to scrabble, trying to find a play. They have to somehow focus on Satsui, but they're somehow whittling down the turtle. They're going to try to go after Satsui, charging it up. No, x was actually trying to go after Edward, trying to interrupt the Fredrin. Somehow they're going to try to steal this turtle under the notes of Blacklist International because if they get it, Whoa! somehow what? Ryota with a punch, a knockout strike to take the turtle for Omega. And that means Omega can team fight. They have the Barretts with them. How the heck did they get that bottom lane? Oheb gets its first tower down. How exactly is happens right now? Their lineup. Having a lot of problems there. X-Rod actually uses the death and his welcome as Jome under the tower against three members of Blacklist International. He eats up the ultimate of the Minotaur as well. Ryota, he sees Oheb. He's going to be able to take him down to the tower. He gets taken down there. Full on knockout strike. The stun as well coming from the floor in. Oh, I'm trying to survive. Embrace his wrath. H2. Actually, no, but no. H2. H2 with an entropy. And the turnaround is it because Oheb, the golden of Blacklist International, is down. But in the bottom lane, Edward was pushing it out. Small win in the fight for Omega, but they're losing map control still. Clutch Entropy by H2 there. He may have been benched for the longest time now, but he still has Killer Instinct set in. Oh, oh. mid lane push from Edward. Haji! Haji, Haji really low here. Oh, oh. Ryota doesn't go for it. Oh. Edward, oh, really Edward, 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 Edward might. Edward just might. Oh, what a retribution. Ryota trying to find it. I, I for no. 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 Ryota! What the flicker, here comes Big J. I'm offended. He is able to find you. The Blacklist getting a free go at the Lord. And something tells me Omega knows, but something has to kick in somewhere. All of these fun fights and plays yeah. are resulting too much for the Barangay. Atoy R. Leader of the Atoy Army, now they're pushing. Oh, Joe misses it. Could have been big if they were able to take down Oheb there. The tower is going to fall, though. Omega trying to equalize Edward. Signs yeah. of, of life Omega may put on. They're still losing on a fundamental sense. Yeah. Uh, again, majority of these players on the side of Blacklist International oh. went through the M5 World Championship, where controlling the map, minion wave control, was so important. That's the modern day game of MLBB. While well, Omega, as you mentioned, Ryota as well. Oh. Oh. He wins the 1v1. He wins the 1v1. <laughs> Makasa gets now, the knockout. And now they're going to be going forward. Exert is going to be able to get the death on his welcome there onto Sensui, but Sensui is really tanky. Haji and Yue trying to find the damage. Abrasion's Wrath gets dealt out. Oheb able to free hit right now. It looks like Omega can't reach Oheb. Ryota once again from the back. Hodge. He's going to be able to get Sensui. He finds Oheb as well. Omega turning it around. Omega has turned it around. The Barangay scores a four for one trade. So now it's even. I can't believe it. Now it's even. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is a uh, Luminous Lord spawning in the lower quarter. H2 going for it. 
Spotted still by yeah. the Echoes. Yue, very hard to miss. Full and length. now the dance begins. Lord here approaching half health. Exhort obliging in the dance. Four members from Omega. Four members from Black. Once again. Going for the soft reset. 1v1! 1v1 to final blow. It's four versus four. The two EXP laners are playing chicken with each other. But so now who's going to get this here? That's the hard reset coming in. One more time. Let's dance. Haji trying to get for the pull. And just like that, Sensui dives in. This is dangerous. Yeah. Oh. Nature is also purple buff dependent, by the way, but it look, he takes it so easily. Whoa! Because push. of Ryota's 1v1, I'd call it technical knockout. He gets yeah. a push. Haji on the right side. Oh, why bush? Watch the map as we're watching the Lord. Sasui here. Haji, great position by him. Oheb here as well. Oh, H2 spots him. He spots him with the entropy. He's not going to get close. Exhort with a Bonk. flicker. Tetra as well. Come out to Haji. The roamer with a massive middle one fury. Is this enough time to ask him? Oh! Sasui goes in. Appraiser's wrath and knockout. But that's what? the kill to the Minotaur. Who got the Lord? It was Agent Zero. Yet again, the fight was split between the two. And it's Black. Blacklist who triumphed, two kills plus the Lord. The Into by the missiles from and Exhort, and then maybe even displaced by one of uh, H2's skills. True. That gave him a little, I don't it's displacement, man, but it went all to yeah. Blacklist's way. Now Lord's going to be marching in. Again. Big five-man echoes. Oh, oh my Agent God. Zero goes in, but he gets dead and is welcomed. Similar to what happened in the game number one, a little bit too eager was Edward and Omega. Are you gonna try to punish Blacklist by you? Press one if you believe. Press two if you think it's it's impossible. <laughs> oh man, the way that uh, Edward has been playing with uh, these little fumbles, I'd like to think more that maybe it is a doppelganger because that mm, that's more of a thing than old man strength. Here we go, <laughs> Lord <laughs> Dance coming up. Lord, less than half health. Okay. Sensui with the pull, soft reset. Neither team letting go. Again, the 1v1 XP laner matchup still happening. Close and to Omega's oh. purple. No welcome. No Detonus welcome. Is anyone going to reset? Jom! Andrew Jom goes Haji. in. Oh, he fights Haji. Middle one Fury. Okay. Still. And Edward. Edward coming in. Patrick Fire like to find a blow. Agent Zero. Now there oh. is something that isn't a mistake. Put the flicker away. But he's going back. Omega still at the Lord. Run, no, we run. Jom again. Double pull. Big damage onto this Ruby. But he falls. Ex uh, Exhort! Actually able to knock by the members of Blacklist through the wall, but no, that's it. Blacklist gets this Lord. There was no Un recompense. <laughs> I don't know what Joan was thinking, man. Me too. Unbelievable jump, though. They needed to help H2. There was no one there with Ouch. him. Everyone else was looking forward to just oh, staying forward. Here we go. Another echo. <laughs> Potentially the final siege here by Blacklist. Penetrating through mid. Next stop, down bottom. Where's the fight going to take him? Lord taken care of here. They lose two inhibitors. Yeah, no flicker for Haji, so no surprise initiation there. Uh, that they will yes. make a play here, make a siege. And then from there, go for the next Lord. Oh, wait, okay, wait, wait, there's wait, a play. Wait. Joe with the pull. I'd like to find a blow to counteract it. Edward is dashing and damaging the members of Omega right now. Whoa! Exhort, able to get away. Sensui has immortality. A Brazier's Wrath gets interrupted by Jumpstone. Oh! oh! But the Star Shatter by the Navaria takes out the Ruby. Omega lose one. Five versus four. But Black was a kind of low. We'll yes. The right side. They do get their health. Oh, down. no way. 100% echoes. Star Shatter onto H2, Entropy committed, Haji with a middle one fear, he gets a knock up H2 as well, but H2, no, look at Edward, he finds the mark on H2, he finds the Nathan, and Blacklist International find the sweep over their rivals, over the Barangay. Playing for Blacks International, able to find H2, back to back to back to score the sweep, 2-0 for Black. And how about that, Yue? Back to back games with perfect usages of the Echo, giving so much of an advantage for Blacklist International. Then Edward. Edward, my man. I really doubted his mistakes because it was very, I don't know, uncanny. Yeah. For Edward, it didn't look like Edward. But that last two jumps <laughs> onto, onto H2, that really looked like Edward. Yeah.